And here is what's happening at 5.30. A Pawtucket woman says a case of stolen identity has led to her getting charged with a crime she says she didn't commit. Good to have you back. I'm Dan Janik. And I'm Emily Bowles. Yeah, she says it all started 30 years ago when her sister took her ID to a club. NBC 10's Gabrielle Caracciolo live in, story, in studio with the story you'll see only on 10. Gabrielle. Well, court documents say Robin Washington and Rachel Seeley are aliases for the same person. But Seeley says this is the case of stolen identity and now she's being wrongfully charged for her sister's crimes. My heart was pounding. Um, I was scared to death. I didn't know what was going on. Rachel Seeley was arrested by Attleboro Police Monday on a warrant dating back to a theft and assault in 2021. I said, well, no, no, no. I said, that's impossible. I said, that's not me. I've never done this in my life. In court, they used both her and her sister, Robin Washington's name. They're basically saying there's only one person and it's me. That Rachel Seeley is AKA Robin Washington and that Robin Washington AKA is Rachel Seeley. The problem started about 30 years ago when Rachel says her sister Robin used her ID to get into a club. Later that night, Robin was arrested, but didn't tell police that the ID in her wallet was actually her sister's. It hurts. It hurts to know that, you know, she used my name and this is the result of it. Proving they're separate people isn't as easy as walking into a courtroom side by side. Robin died last year. It's a lot to deal with, especially knowing that my sister's no longer here. Rachel and their mom have documents they say prove her innocence, including this notarized letter Robin wrote from jail while serving time for another crime, explaining how she took her sister's ID. I've always gotten mistaken for my sister. People have always came up to me like, oh, Robin, hey, how are you? And knowing that I'm Rachel and I'm not Robin, but there are two of us, you know, and they need to fix this. The court needs to fix this. They need to fix it. Um, I don't want to continue to go through this. Seekonk police tell me their records show Robin Washington is the suspect from the August 2021 theft and assault. They say their warrant was issued in that name, but Attleboro police showed me the warrant in the state system says the last name Seely. Seekonk police say they're now looking into the matter. In studio, Gabrielle Caracciolo, NBC 10 News.